torture devices for your kids and a sign set that literally contains uranium. Today we count down the top 10 what the f toys for kids. Yay! Number 10. The daddy saddle, you know? Who doesn't want to ride their dads and who doesn't want their kids on their back riding them for hours and hours? So this is unsettled to put on your dad to ride them. Why would you ever make this? Or why would you ever buy this? Number 9. The lovely straight jacket for your kids. Just look how nicely she's smiling. If you don't know what a straight jacket is, it's a device thing that you put on crazy people. So yeah, it's actually kind of a torture device for your kid because why don't you want to torture your kids? Because that's the funnest thing to do, to torture your kids. Number 8. Made by the same people of the lovely straight jacket. Yay. Comes now the funny cage. Best thing ever. So now you can lock your kid in a cage to, I don't know, to put him in a cage and you can put, I don't know, a sandwich through the bars, but you can put your kid in there. Funnest and most perfect toy ever. Best Christmas present ever. Wow. Quality toy. Really. I'm, I'm deadly serious. Wow. Number seven. You know how fun they are, they are clackers and you can smash your own fingers off Also you can just smack your face and people get injured all day long It's like clackers, they will destroy your soul Clackers, they will just kill you all Clackers are these things, they are two hard balls They are made of glass or just hard plastic And you can clack them Woo! Yippee! And also, you can just put your fingers in between and then you can see your hand get smashed and crushed and see your bones break. How fun is that? And these things are uh, particularly made to smack your own face. So, pff, this is the best toy ever. Number 6. Burger King's Pokeball. So you buy a Happy Meal, or I don't know how it's called, but you buy a Happy Meal at Burger King, and you get this toy, and kids are all happy with their toy. They are like, "Mommy, can I have a Pokeball with my Happy Meal?" And they get a Pokeball, and they're all like, "Yeah!" And then they're gonna play with it, and then they die. They die. They just die. There are people that choked in it. And this Pokeball is perfectly designed to suck your face off and just get stuck between your mouth and your nose and it will suck out the oxygen and stuff and they break really quick, uh, quickly and they, the little pieces will just, just, just stick in your skin and blood will come out and you just choke in it and actually some kids just put that the whole Pokeball in their mouth and they break their jaw obviously or you just choke in it just I don't see in any way this isn't the best toy ever it's perfect if you hate your child number five this just terrifies me just the story with what people what happened to them after they bought the easy bake oven yeah it's really easy to just melt your own hand away so what happened with the easy bake, o bake oven was little girls put their hand in it they just put their hand in it and then they get this door and just just break their own iron just break their arm with the they just get their hand stuck in the Easy Bake Oven. The Easy Bake Oven turns on and they actually get third, not second, not first, just third degree burns. And they get stuck. And the Easy Bake Oven turns on, third degree burns, and it's really hot. They Their hand melts away, burns 
completely away until it's it's gone. Just that that easy bake oven is the evil bake oven. Because what do you bake in there? You bake your own hand in there. And even the creepiest story about this is a five-year-old girl put her hand in it and just waited until her, her own hand just melted away. So her hand was completely gone. She needed to replace her hand. What? So, easy bake oven, yeah, yeah, best toy ever. Oh, just, it's just creepy. It's just, it's just scary. It's just, ugh. Ugh. Number four, penguin toy figure. Ooh, creepy. Well, no, just look at it, it seems, uh, really peaceful. It, it doesn't seem like it could hurt someone. And it's about a uh, football size, so you can't choke on it. So, why is this a weird band toy, you may ask? Well, there is a story behind it. What is really, really terrifying. Even creepier than most creepy pastas, and spoiler alert: creepy pastas are fake. But this one is real. Wow! And um, yeah, I'm just gonna copy paste this story and submit it on my Deviant Art and get a lot of likes. That's a great idea. But here's the story: <coughs> a boy was uh, wanted to know. How this toy works. So what this toy does, it wobbles around. It just wobbles around. Ooh! This t this guy boy wanted to know how it works. So he pulled the hat, the head of the penguin off. The end. No, listen. He puts the head off, and inside of it. Not inside of the head, inside of the, re the, the just the rest of the penguin are sharp needles, just iron bars or something. I don't know who is the maker of this, but why would you ever put, I don't know, glass shards inside of a toy? It was filled with sharp things. What? 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 Okay, okay, okay. What? I just don't understand. But the story doesn't end there. So the boy is like, oh, there are sharp things in there. He gets his hand and puts it inside of it. He puts his hand in a penguin filled with sharp things. Okay, in this story, there are two stupid people. First of all, the maker of this toy. Second of all, this 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 boy that thinks like, oh, I'm gonna put my hand in in a penguin with sharp stuff. Well, I can't think of any, any other situation. I'm gonna put my hand in a penguin with sharp needles. So terrifying and yeah his hand just gets cut and chopped and crushed and sharp needles are oh you don't want to know what happened with the boy so this penguin is not not just a toy it's just a creepy Penguin doll filled with sharp stuff. Number three. Um, I probably think you know this one because it is Aqua Dots. It um yeah, and our Aqua Dots, and if you don't know what it is, it's like you can have like this dots and you can put them on 
a board to make like pixel art-ish uh, things, but it looks colorful and bright and it actually looks like berries or candy. So obviously some kids put it in their mouth and the makers didn't think of that. I did, uh. Wow, so that, that's not all. These kids put it in their mouth and they get actually extremely sick. So yeah, why not just water with flavor? No, 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 just edible color things, coloring that's edible and not extremely poisonous. But the best part of this toy is you can use the aqua dots as a drugs. Number two, jarts. I don't know. It's it's something between joy and arts or just darts and something with a G. J. J. Oh. But um, yeah, there are just darts and you can throw them. But it actually is like this. In this box, it contains um, some things. It contains these jarts and hula hoops things. The jarts are actually giant darts. And if you don't know what a, jar a dart is, it's a little thing you throw and it has a sharp point. And you know what's the best idea ever? Make them bigger and make them even. Oh. So, what you actually need to do is uh, you have two teams, and the team needs to. You need to throw the, the jarts in the hula hoop. The other team is standing next to the hula hoop. So, if you're a little kid, and um, yeah, you can throw next to the hula hoop. Okay, no big deal. Yes, it's a big deal. You throw just you just thrown a jart in someone's leg, or in even the worst cases, you throw it in someone's head. This toy actually caused four deaths. Four innocent kids died of this giant darts. Yeah, it seems really safe, right? No! Giant darts! Why, why... Why did someone think this was ever a good idea? I, I, I quit. This... I... Oh my god. I, this is... This is really, I quit. Why? I quit. And the number one most WTF moments toy just oh when I saw this I was like WTF OMG <laughs> okay I was like what but okay it's called the Atomic Energy Lab seems innocent seems just like some fun science project or something so it contains it seems like um, a cloud chamber and um, just some things ooh just oh it looks like great fun Gilbert Hall of Science oh exciting safe if you look closely under the picture of the kid you really can see the word safe this toy is anything except safe. This is the perfect gift if you go to, I don't know, a terrorist. If your kid is a terrorist, this is a perfect gift. Because this toy set contains uranium. If you don't know what uranium is, it's really radioactive 
So, why should you ever give your kid radioactive uranium? Obviously, you can make a bomb out of this. So, I don't get it why the word SAFE is standing there. That's all for today. If you want more top 10s, let me know. Hope you like, subscribe, share, and hope to you next time. Bye.